Sleeping on the rooftop, I dreamt of the starry sky in the pitch black darkness. Uh, are you up? Uh, oh, the sun? Why are you here? I, I just happened to come here and saw you sleeping, Amano. So I woke you up. That's all. Thank you. Uh, how come your face is all red? It's nothing. We have to get back to class. Oh, uh, sure. It gets restless during lunch break because Gyarus gather around Yuka Oda, who sits next to me. Who do you like, Yuka? You like someone, right? Tell us about him. That's a secret. What? Don't keep it a secret. How could they talk about such a thing in the middle of the classroom? Uh, I can't understand how these Gyaru's minds work. I know. It's a senpai in the 12th grade, isn't it? Or that university student who spoke to you in town the other day. Well, you're both wrong. Anyway, I'm sure it's not an introvert like him. Whoa! You always look so tired. Why do you stay up so late? Hey, you two. Don't tease Amano too much. Why do they tease me so much? It's just so restless in the classroom. That's why the rooftop is the best place to take a nap, because no one bothers you. I dreamt of the starry sky in the pitch black darkness yesterday. Today's dream is, huh? Hot pink hearts? <sighs> hey, it's too early to wake up. Uh, what are you doing, Oda-san? Well, nothing. Did you come to wake me up again today? I was just watching your silly face. Doesn't she have anything else to do? Uh, don't be late for the next class. Uh, uh, oh, okay. She's a Gyaru, but she's serious. Or is she a serious Gyaru? Huh. She's hard to read. Anyway, I don't understand her much, but she's nice to me. Unlike other Gyaru, she doesn't make fun of me for being an introvert. She's unexpectedly earnest. I have to get rid of my stereotype for Gyarus. The next day... Oh no. Why am I waiting for Oda-san to come and wake me up? I was gonna take a nap at the rooftop as usual, but I couldn't go to sleep. Thinking about Oda-san. Then, all of a sudden, it got dark. I, I can feel someone's here. Someone's looking into my face. He's so cute when he's sleeping. What? This voice? It, it's Oda-san? Let me touch his cheek. Here. Oh. Here. Oh, she's poking my cheek. I completely lost a chance to wake up, and I learned one thing then. Has she been playing pranks like this on me while I was sleeping? That doesn't make me feel happy. But... I don't think she meant any harm. It's Oda-san, after all. Or, or does she? I don't know. He's not waking up at all. He won't notice even if I kiss him on the cheek, right? What? What is she talking about? Just a little. Only for a little... So it's okay, right? Then why is she talking like a little baby? I looked the other way to avoid her. Still pretending to be asleep. I think it was a clever move. Boo. I was almost there. So she was seriously gonna kiss me? I couldn't read her mind at all, and she wouldn't give up, so it made me even more freaked out. Playing pranks while I'm sleeping and trying to kiss me on the cheek? Does she think of me as a huge baby? Maybe Oda-san likes to play mother and baby. <gasps> what if she thinks of me as a baby and has been doing whatever she wanted to me? That makes me confused. Because I, I, I'm just a normal guy. There is no need to play stuff like that in the real world. Hey, introvert. What kind of naughty things are you thinking about? What? I, I am not. Really? Anyway, we have pee next, so I can borrow your pee clothes. Huh? Why do you want to borrow mine? Why not? It's not as if I'm asking you to give them to me. That's right. You want pee clothes with the smell and sweat of a high school girl, don't you? N no. What is it, Yuka? Amano seems troubled. You can borrow my pee clothes. Well, yours are too small. Just use mine and go. 
Oda-san forced her PE clothes on her friends and made them leave the classroom. Th that was close? Jeez, Amano. Y yes You keep your guard down too much. You shouldn't do that in front of others, but save that for... Not in front of others? Wait, what? So I'm telling you not to keep your guard down! Oh, oh, oh okay, I'm... sorry? Why is she angry at me? And you shouldn't lend your pee clothes, especially to girls. Other things too! Oh, okay? But they're my stuff. Why is she telling this to me? I really don't understand her. I don't know why she's so upset. First of all, why does she always mess with me? That's all I have to say. But I'm not trying to be overprotective or anything. I'm not trying to act like your girlfriend. I'm not thinking anything like that. Oh, the sun. I was thinking about her while lying in bed. She's a gyaru, but she's serious and pretty. And she plays tricks on me while I'm sleeping. I still have no idea about her baby play. Maybe she thinks of me as a big baby. <sighs> I really don't understand what the sun. Also, what was she talking about with her friends the other day? Who does she like? I wasn't feeling well from lack of sleep the next day. Hey, are you okay, Amano? Uh, yeah. Amano, you, you look pale. You didn't get enough sleep last night? N no. If you're feeling sick, you should go to the nurse's office. Tell the nurse why you're there. Alright. I couldn't sleep at all. I was thinking about Oda-san all night. Uh, of course I couldn't tell the truth, so I said that I was playing video games until late and asked to get some rest. I laid down on the bed, but I couldn't sleep. I just stayed in bed, looking up at the ceiling. After a while, class was over and it was recess. Amano, are you there? Are you okay? I heard Oda-san's voice. I closed my eyes immediately and pretended to be asleep. It feels... awkward to see her today. I hope nothing's gonna happen. He's asleep. He's cute when he's asleep. But his cheeks are so cute. No, oh, she can be so ruthless. Don't take pictures without asking. <laughs> He's not waking up at all, so I'm gonna do the usual. What the heck is the usual? And it became dark. I, I think I've had this feeling before. I felt her put her feet on the sides of my ears. And I knew for certain. Wow! Is Oda-san standing over me right now? He never wakes up. If he does, he could see me in this embarrassing posture. So if I open my eyes now... Oh no! Does she know that I'm just pretending to be asleep? I I is she flirting with me? Confusion, excitement, chaos, dreams, hopes and expectations! I had no idea she was playing this kind of trick on me. Does this mean that the starry sky and pitch black darkness and hot pink hearts were not actually my dreams? How can he be so dull? It's so funny that he doesn't wake up when I'm doing this to him. Boo! This is getting frustrating! So she was making fun of me for being an introvert? She's probably trying to provoke me! Knowing that I'm just pretending to be asleep. Um... Yes? What is it? What? I've been up for a while. What are you doing, Oda-san? Ah, Amano! I, I was just... And I can see everything. You were awake? Did you see? Uh, that's what I told you. Today, they're the blue and white flag of Argentina, aren't they? I didn't see Sol de Mayo, though. What do you mean by today? Then you have... Th what the heck are you doing? Nothing! Why did you open your eyes? It doesn't work if you open your eyes. How does it work? Anyway, I'm sorry for playing a weird trick on you. I'm sorry. You don't have to apologize. I I just want to know the reason why you did that. And Oda-san hesitantly started talking. I sometimes fantasize how you would react. Huh? I want you to see, but I don't want you to see. I, I don't understand at all. If you want to do something like that, why don't you do it someplace else? 
It has to be you. Why? Anyway, you've seen me. Oh no, what should I do? What should I know? I just don't understand her. Let me see yours too. Huh? Why? We can be even. I don't know what you're talking about. It's not fair that you've only seen mine. It's not a matter of being fair or not. It, it stop pulling on my pants. Just a little. Just a little. Whoa, you can't pull them anymore. You, you, you can almost see them. Hey, you guys. Oh. Uh, do that somewhere else. No, what are you guys doing? He saw my panties. Th that's not true. She showed me hers, and she forced me to. Well, if you guys are feeling well, can you just leave? And we were thrown out of the nurse's office. Next day during lunch break, I went up to the rooftop and... Huh? There was someone unexpected there, sleeping with her arms and legs sprawled out. Um, Oda-san? <sighs> She's obviously not sleeping. Um, what are you doing? She doesn't wake up even when I speak to her. Hmm. It must be a new prank. She's being too defenseless. And I got an idea. She's not trying to play a prank on me. She's waiting for me to play a prank on her. I don't have to take her bait so easily. But remembering yesterday's incident and all the other pranks she's played on me, I was feeling a little naughty. She's not waking up. Then maybe I'll play a prank on her. Uh... You're not waking up, so you can't say anything no matter what I do to you. Oh, I remember you saying something about kissing on the cheek before. It seems as if you're not waking up, so I'll just... Uh... My face got closer to Oda-san, and... Here! <laughs> Hmm. It's different from what I expected. What are you doing? I'm just getting back at you for all the silly things you've done to me. That just made you look silly. Hey, stop making me look silly. This is embarrassing. Well, it wasn't as silly as I thought it would be. Uh-huh. You looked cute. C cute? But your silly face was silly. Uh, hey. <laughs> <laughs> the bell rang then. I tried to get away from Oda-san with her face all blushed, but... D d hey, Oda-san! Don't jump on my back so suddenly! You can't just leave me! Just go all the way to the classroom like this! What? That can be... too dangerous, and I can see stuff on my back. You don't actually have to say that, idiot! She really is a bit strange. I don't understand much about her, and I have no idea what she expects me to do. But she can be unexpectedly interesting. And pretty as well. I wish I could go out with someone like her. <laughs>